Hey guys, Shock here from Shocky Tech, and in today's video, we are going to be sharing three hidden features which are extremely useful for your Samsung Galaxy smartphone. So let's dive in and discover right away. All right, so the very first thing I'm going to talk about is actually a hidden clipboard. Let me demonstrate what I'm talking about and how to actually use it. I'm going to use Samsung Notes to demonstrate. So let's say I select this and I copy it. And then I select this again, and I copy this, and then I select this again, and I copy this as well. So basically, I selected this, copied it, then I did this, then I did this. So the last thing that's been copied is this guy right here. So I've lost those, or so you would think. They're actually all saved in a clipboard. So anything you've copied, even days ago, is still accessible in a hidden clipboard. Again, all you do is you bring up your keyboard, you tap on the three dots, and then you go to your clipboard right here. And that clipboard is going to have everything selected as you can see. So that was the last one, that was the one before that still here, and the one before that still there. And I can scroll down forever, it's going to store a whole bunch of my previous copies. And also very important, if you want to access anything that was old, for example, let me just uh, bring up the keyboard, go down here, I can simply go in here and just tap on the one that I want to access. It'll just copy itself. I can even copy and paste photos that I had copied from days ago. Sometimes this can be a lifesaver if you accidentally overwrote an important piece of text or anything, even a photo, as you can see right here, that you've copied. Powerful feature, let's move on to the next one. But before that, just a quick word from our sponsor. A real quick message from our sponsor, Omaze. Omaze is running a very special giveaway. They are giving away a $4.3 million Los Angeles dream house, which has five bedrooms, six bathrooms, an in-home movie theater, and a basketball court, to name a few things. If you win this, you can live your LA fantasy life, and as you know, LA is the epicenter of entertainment with a very vibrant nightlife. Now, this house is way too luxurious. For instance, the main bedroom has a fireplace, a walk-in closet, soaking tub and an oversized shower the winner also gets a chance to either choose the house or a multi-million dollar cash prize instead of the house and also for this giveaway omaze has also partnered with rebuilding together charity which is devoted to repairing the homes of veterans people with disabilities and neighbors with low income to help keep communities intact so for your chance to win the 4.3 million dollar house and also to support rebuilding together charity for a great cause go to omaze.com slash tech for which the links are down below and if you enter between January the 17th and February the 2nd you will also be automatically entered for a chance to win a Tesla Model Y on top of the house links are down below the next powerful feature has to do with edge panels particularly I'm talking about the smart select panel and I'm sure you've seen this before but the option at the bottom here is one of the most powerful features, especially for multitasking and stuff like that. Let me show you how it works. I'm going to show you guys how to activate it in case you don't have it enabled. So to demonstrate what it does, I'm just going to quickly create a scenario. Let me just go to this website here. Let's say I'm doing some kind of research on semiconductors for a paper. And let's say I scroll down and here's a paragraph that I want to take some ideas out of as I'm typing my own paper. So what I can do is I can pull my edge panel, I can tap on pin to screen, and then I can select that paragraph just like this, and then simply tap pin to screen, and what happens is it cuts that area and pins that information to the top right here, so I can have it on the screen at all times. And I do wanna let you know it is in fact movable, so I can put it anywhere you want, now the next thing I want to do is I want to pull up my notes application. So I'm going to go to my notes application. Let me just create a new note. And let's say I was taking some notes here. So I can some take some notes, extract and rephrase and paraphrase and take and write some notes right here. Okay. And this thing is going to be floating here all the time as long as you need it. Now once you're done with it, you tap on it. Okay. 
and you can either save it as an image, uh, make it, minimize it so it just stays on the side. You can even have it a little guy right here and just have it on the side if you want to do something more. So you write, 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 and then you, then you grab this guy, you tap on it, it's going to expand, you can use it, and again, you can minimize it. Or tap it again, exit out, and you're done. When you're done, you just exit out. So fantastic little feature. To enable this feature, go to the settings, go to display, scroll down, go to edge panels, make sure they're turned on, tap on panels, and make sure smart select is enabled, then you're able to actually pull it in from the side uh, from your edge panels right here. Powerful feature, let's move on to the next one. All right, so the next feature has to do with your keyboard. So here I have a note, and normally when you wanna edit a note, let's say you wanna put your cursor somewhere right here. You can put it here and here with a tap, but sometimes you cannot get the exact location. Now there is a powerful hidden feature right in the keyboard on the space bar that allows you to press and hold this thing and turn this entire thing into a trackpad. So I can move this cursor exactly where I want it to go and make micro adjustments to my text. So very simple, press and hold the space bar. Then you get that cursor control, you can move it back and forth, up and down as you please. All right, so that brings us to the end of this video. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, drop them down below. Let me know for now, guys. Have a fantastic day, all right?